All right, but wait, kids, there's more. All right, now let's get the times in the scriptures where it's actually talking about your heart, <laughs> which, you know, we rarely get those scriptures. This is uh, 2 Kings chapter 9, verse 24, right? And Jehu drew a bow with his full strength and smote Jehoram between his arms. And the arrow went out at his heart, right? And he sunk down in his chariot. So verse 24, and Jehu drew a bow with his full strength and smote Je Jehoram between his arms. And the arrow went out at his heart and he sunk down in his chariot. So that's actually talking about that he was getting his heart because it gives it away. And it went between his arms and he shot an arrow, right? And it went out at his heart. It's not talking about your mind. Your mind is in your brain, <laughs> right? This is this is actually his heart being in being shot at with an arrow, and the arrow went out at his heart, and and he sunk down in his chariot. This is set, this is a uh, First Kings, chapter chapter nine, verse twenty four, where it's actually talking about the heart, right? To get the second account, this is um, Second Edges, chapter sixteen. Verse 61, verse 61, he made man and put his heart in the midst of the body and gave him breath and life and understanding. So we're going to read that again. Verse 61, he made man and put his heart in the midst of the body. This is talking about he actually put the heart in the midst of the body because where is your heart? In the middle of your body right? and gave him breath, life and understanding. Right, so you know these instances do not put up a fight. Right, it's these instances the heart is talking about your actual heart. Verse sixty-one, just to put it in the mind. Second Edges, ch chapter Second Edges, chapter sixteen, verse sixty-one. He made man and put his heart in the midst of the body, and gave him breath, life, and understanding. Mm. It's talking about the mystery of your body. A lot of people may imagine the heart, you know, looking at somebody downward, saying the mind is in the middle. No, right? That's talking about your heart is in the middle of your body. It's in the midst of the body. That's what mist means, in the middle. He made man and put his heart in the middle of the body and gave him breath, life, and understanding. Right? So with that, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to the Most High God, Jehovah. I do so in the name of His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai, whom the world eternally calls Jesus Christ. Given saying, Shalom. Hope this was edifying. Shalom, Israel.